I would just like to uh, encourage uh, persons uh, that uh, to, to, to weigh the pros and cons of the vaccine, uh, to, to do your research on the vaccine, and then to also understand that it is building another layer of protection uh, and another layer of, of keeping someone else from catching it as well. Here at First Baptist, we are a predominantly African-American congregation, so we know uh, what has been said in the news and other media about uh, being disproportionately affected by uh, the COVID-19 uh, virus. And also we are a uh, more senior uh, membership here at First Baptist uh, who are, you know, as we say, uh, more affected as well. My reason for taking it is because not just for myself, uh, but also for the safety of others as, as well. Uh, and being active in the community and having to be having to be out and around people, I felt that I needed to do that. I believe it's very important that we do what we can, what was what is within our power to help get things back to whatever that new normal is going to be. Because uh, social, uh, being uh, able to be together socially uh, plays a, a huge role in the lives of people. We're not meant to be alone. You're actually adding another level of protection other than social distancing, wearing a mask, and washing your hands. With the vaccine, you're adding another level of, of protection, uh, building up your immune system to help fight off uh, this uh, coronavirus. 500,000 lives to be lost to the coronavirus in these past 11 months. So weigh your options, do your research, uh, and, and understand that it is providing another layer of protection for you and for those you love and those that you come in contact with.